the Asia Pacific Accreditation and Certification Commission, or APAC, as one of the specific targets in the implementation of the CPSC Corporate Plan 2003 to 2008, was formally established through the Seoul Declaration of 2004 in Seoul, Republic of Korea. With the support and commitment of representatives from 17 member governments from Afghanistan, Bangladesh, Fiji, India, Indonesia, Iran, Japan, Korea, Malaysia, Maldives, Mongolia, Myanmar, Nepal, Pakistan, Papua New Guinea, Philippines, and Sri Lanka signing the declaration with CPSC as the lead organization. APEC will ensure that it is able to guide technical and vocational education and training or TVET institutions in equipping themselves with internationally recognized standards and systems. The Seoul Declaration of 2004 was further strengthened by the continued support and commitment to the mission and goals of APEC as expressed by participating governments through the Manila Resolution 2005 and China Affirmation of Commitment 2007. The 2007 China Affirmation of Commitment signed on June 29, 2007 encapsulates the recommendations made during the experts' meetings on competence building in APEC organization including the approval of the APAC Foundation documents, namely Accreditation Manual, Accreditation Instrument and Handbook for Accreditors, and APAC Guide. In compliance with the mandate, APAC shall perform the following functions. Develop accreditation criteria, evaluation instruments, processes, and protocols for the accreditation of DBET institutions. Establish linkages or partnership with national accrediting agencies of member countries. Recruit, train, and develop and retrain a pool of accreditors on a full-time or on-call basis. Directly provide or seek other services to provide funds and other resources to carry out the program of accreditation and certification and be a source of good practices for the promotion of quality in the technical and vocational education and training system. Conduct accreditation and certify the corresponding accreditation status earned among DVET institutions in Asia and the Pacific region, giving priority to institutions in Colombo Plan and APEC accreditation is an internationally recognized sign of quality. Accredited institutions enjoy these and other benefits. Facilitates workforce mobility and mutual recognition of qualifications in Asia and the Pacific region. Quality and employable workforce in member countries through APEC coordination among its network of institutions, agencies, and other stakeholders. Creates employer confidence on the selection of employees coming from accredited institutions. International recognition of the institution's quality, accountability, and public trust. Eligibility and reliability of TVET institutions for funding support from donors and other lending agencies. Being a part of a regional network of quality institutions that expands schooling and learning opportunities for students and facilitates transferability of credits earned by a student among educational institutions. In the future, high cooperation among institutions will be required on the basis of the principle of increasing workforce mobility. 
National policy support shall enhance the promotion and advocacy for institutions to strengthen their own quality processes and systems, and the regionally accredited and certified institutions in Tibet, who will produce graduates capable enough to cross borders and share globally oriented skills and technology. Therefore, the Asia-Pacific Accreditation and Certification Commission, in pursuit and aspiration of helping Asia-Pacific countries, will become a regional catalyst to promote quality assurance in Tibet institutions.